busting on your door, big bird. Moji through your crib at night like I'm Squidward. Went, 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 went through your hallway. What's up, guys? James DTV here. So I got an iPod Touch fourth generation off of eBay for like 22 bucks. So yeah, we're, we're gonna take a look at it. So um, yeah, today's July 7th, uh, 2022. Uh, it's like 6.33 a.m. as of recording this video. So yeah, it's a fourth gen iPod Touch. It's got a fake phone app, these two are fake. I was trying to see which one looks better and they both look about the same. But, yeah, no, this thing, it's pretty cool. You know, it's a fourth gen. And uh, let me just turn this off. But yeah, look at the back. The back is actually pretty shiny compared to the other two that I have. I have one that's damaged that I got before this one. Like, a week before this one. Actually, the day I got that one, when it broke, it broke the same day I got it. I was trying to fix the front camera, and then I accidentally damaged the LCD connector on the board. So I just turned it into, into a display item, and it was an 8 gig, so I ordered this 16 gig off of eBay. Uh, you know, for 20 bucks, and after tax, and was like 22 so you know um open this you know it's on ios 6 this is the first one with the retina screen uh last one with the shiny back first one with the camera and also last one with the 30 pin dock connector and the smaller screen now this thing's not that bad you know the battery life is terrible on here it's worse than the other one i had so I'm going to have to do something about that. I don't know anything about micro soldering or anything like that. Not even regular soldering. So uh, I'm not going to be able to fix this myself. I'm going to have to have someone help me. I do have another one that my friend gave me that's an 8 gig touch. It's got kind of a deformed housing. So yeah, I got to fix that one too. It's got a broken screen. Honestly, the deformed housing I can deal with. It's just the screen doesn't work. It needs new power and volume buttons because my dumbass broke it. I um, was trying to put the screen off of the other 8 gig I had that's now a display item and then uh, let's just say that the solder joints broke. Well, not the solder joints, but like the, the place it was soldered on the ribbon cable, it just ripped. So yeah, and the screen didn't, the screen off the other one didn't even work anymore anyway, so it was kind of a waste. Yeah, no, that one just needs the power and volume buttons and the screen. It could also go for a new speaker, too, because that got damaged in the process. But, um, yeah, this one works. Now, I don't have the YouTube app. It's actually just a Safari shortcut on my home screen. Uh, the phone app is a decoy. Both phone apps are decoys, except for TalkU, which is a calling app. I have my my phone number linked to it you know it works only for making calls right now i can call places but then it costs credits because why not you know i have vlc which has most of my music on it like this blurst of times by dank miss also known as dank pods now yeah it's a pretty good song you know it's it's from it, it's basically just the simpsons here, I'll, I'll play a little more of it. Hopefully, now I get copyright strike. Ah, the old iOS. And then also this. This is pretty cool. I kind of wish iOS still had this. I mean, the new music player in iOS 16 is way different. I mean, it's very different. Let me just intern my passcode. And then this is before the control center. You had this. And then you could adjust the volume here. There is no flashlight. There was no flashlight toggle even on the iPhone or the iPod Touch 5th Gen until iOS 7. So, you know, since this didn't have a flashlight, I have two different apps for this. You see dead pixels up there. They've actually shifted. Over here, it's not even bad anymore, and it's kind of shrunken down. Yeah, no, and then it turns white, which is pretty cool. It just turns the screen really bright white. Um iHome set is for my clock radio. Uh, the World is like a Twitter app, you know. Um, it's a third-party Twitter app. If you guys want to follow me, there's my Twitter handle. Um, yeah, Talk You, as I said, is a calling app. I have a third-party weather app because the original iOS 6 weather app is the same for iOS 7. No longer works. Neither does the Stocks app. That's because the services Apple use are out of date. You know, Apple never stopped using them in, like, iOS 8, I think. 
So they got rid of the services and they shut down. FaceTime I've been having issues with. If you have a 4th gen iPod Touch on iOS 6, let me know if you've had FaceTime issues. It could be that I'm using my iPhone to make the call to my iPod, even though they're on separate Apple IDs, but they're on the same net. Well, they're really close to each other, so that could be what's causing the issue. Uh, Maps doesn't work, so if you guys have like a 3GS or an iPod Touch 4 on iOS 6, please let me know if your Maps application works. Because I've been having it to where it doesn't even it doesn't even work properly. I don't know if location services doesn't work because I was having errors with one app with location services. The rest of them work. Yeah, you know, and then um, I do use clock because I have an alarm. 7 a.m. I'm awake before my alarm all the time for some reason. Reminders works. iTunes and apps are actually made the first purchase on iTunes in about like four years, and it's no maintenance by Crispy Concords. Because why not? Why not get get that song? It's actually a pretty good song. You know, I have a third-party weather app, third-party Twitter app, YouTube shortcut for uh, Safari. I've got uh, games on here. I have Infection, Talking Ben Hill, Climb Racing, and Plants vs. Zombies. I had to get Talking Ben, you know. I wanted to see if it actually worked on here. I was like, it should. It's pretty old. Talking Ben is actually pretty old. You know, and then here's the camera app. Not very good camera, 0 0.7 megapixels. And then the front camera is 0 0.3. Stink and record, uh, not so good video. I might do a YouTube video where I use this as a camera. You know, so these phone apps, as I said, are decoys. Honestly, it's pretty nice. And we'll go into settings, as you can see, you know, uh, older iOS, uh, general, about 6.1.6. .6. It's a 16 gigabyte. Uh, we'll go to brightness and wallpaper. We'll go here to wallpaper. Wallpaper. See, we got the actual iOS 6 one. This one. Uh, this is the one I use. This one's been around since iOS 4. They don't have it anymore. I, I think they got rid of it in iOS 7, but, you know, iOS 4, 5, and 6 had that wallpaper. Now, if any of you guys remember seeing the old clownfish wallpaper from the first iPhone... Apple brought it back in iOS 16 Developer Beta 3. I installed Developer Beta 3 on my personal phone, which is filming this video right now. I know it's probably not a good idea to install the beta on personal devices, but I had 15.6 on here for a while. So, you know, like, I was like, ah, what the heck, why not? And it actually runs really nice. And I like the new wallpaper. It's actually got a pretty cool, like, effect when you turn on the screen. So it seems more 3D. Yeah, no, it's pretty cool that they brought back that old wallpaper. Yeah, no, I use the default iOS 4 wallpaper. Uh, I did have a custom wallpaper at one point, but I, I don't remember what, why I changed it. Yeah, no, uh, this thing works pretty well. Yeah, no, the calendar works. You know, all this stuff sort of works, even though it's iOS 6. Just not weather and stocks, and I'm having issues with maps and FaceTime. Yeah, no, Safari works decently. Mail works pretty well. Um, yeah, all this stuff works really well, except for FaceTime, stocks, maps, and weather. But, you know, um, newsstand doesn't work. Most apps I try to download off the app store say this app is incompatible with this iPhone, even though this is an iPod Touch, not an iPhone. I am thinking about jailbreaking this thing so I can fix that issue, and I can actually install apps on here, more apps on here. Because I could probably get an older version of Instagram on here, an older version of Twitter, an older version of um, Facebook. That's about it. I can't get an older version of YouTube. Well, I could actually. And I could fix it to work. I don't know if I'll do that. But yeah, no, I got to use a computer to do that. I don't have a computer that works right now. I have a Chromebook, but that's not going to work for this. So I can't even do the jailbreak right now. But yeah. Anyway, you know, that's about it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. A bitch with thighs like Mewtwo. Moan boys playing on the Bluetooth. 19 bitches like Juju. You know I keep a check like Blue's Clues. Hey, what?